There we go, bar resistance, and we'll start warming up. I have a chair as well, um, just because always, you know, it helps with balance. When it helps with balance, I'm all for it. So again, you know, anytime you need a chair, <clears throat> toes are pointed forward, wide stance. I'm gonna inhale, bend the knees, really stretch and reach. And I'm telling you what, I am super duper duper sore. So we're gonna have some stretching flexibility in this. Inhale, big and deep, make it super dynamic. <laughs> I'm downloading this to YouTube. Don't worry. And I'll make sure it's on public. <laughs> okay, right here. Lean and back up. I have never seen you on this video. Lean. Lean. I am so sore all throughout my upper body right now. This stretch is going to feel good. Two more. One more. Arms out. Down. Scoop. Bend the knees and roll it up. Dive down. Bend the knees. Scoop it. And then back up. Two more like that. Open it. One more. Dive down. Okay. We're going to change our position. We're going to be in a split lunge. We're going to go arms overhead. Down and up. Down. Just warm up the legs. Go as deep as you can. If you want to hang out to your chair right here, you can do that. Four. Just like that. Six, seven, one more, eight. Now we're gonna aim it down. Now down, down, and up. Two, shifting our, our we're, how we're bending our upper body is gonna shift where we're aiming. Two more, one more. Now just pump, pump the bottom, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Toes are out wide now. Inhale, exhale, inhale, scoop it up. Exhale, inhale. One more. Don't know what I did there with my arms. <laughs> Face this way. Now we're gonna have, again, we're upright with our body on this one. Two, three, four. Okay, we're gonna aim down now. Aim down. Two more. Up at the bottom now. Eight. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, two, one. Pull it in. Okay. Pull those knees and let's shake it up. <laughs> You're at work. Okay. I was like, wait a minute. Never with us on this. Underneath. Two, three. 
seven, eight more, eight, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna be in a static split and we're gonna lunge down. Just on one side now. Hold it here. Three, four, five. If you need a chair, hang on to it. Now aim down and hold it. And back to center. So on this one, our body's upright. Push the butt back. Push the arms forward. Five, six, seven, eight. Now hands down, face down. Okay, right here, let's just go down to hands and knees. We're gonna alternate lunging a foot to the hand and pressing the hips forward. So, press, return, press. Now this is for anybody such as Paula, if you're not fully able to get on your toes in a plank, then you're gonna stay with this. And then I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna change it after two more to a plank and a lunge. Okay, now to a plank. If you want, stay with what you had. I'm gonna pull this arm back and switch. Do this on your knees. Again, if you're modifying at all. Pull. Stay in that good plank. I'm starting to feel more flexible every time I do this. Pull. Two more like this. And I'm gonna change it. Okay, last one. We're gonna continue with the lunging. We're gonna change the arms. Circle. Circle. Circle it back. I'm gonna change right here. Two more. Hold that nice plank when you return it. One more. Okay, right here. Hands and knees. Press. Child's pose. Reach the fingertips as far forward as you can. Now, hands directly under shoulders. You're gonna press the hips forward and you're gonna look up. Engage your toes, pressing a downward dog. Butt pose up, head goes through the arms, heels go into the ground. Lunge a hand to the foot, circle it around. Press it into downward dog. Lunge a foot and circle it around. We're gonna do this six more times. This is really helping you with flexibility and mobility. Go to the hands and knees. I'm in lunge if you need to.
We have one more. Press. Last one here. Now, back to hands and knees. We're gonna widen our knees open and just press the butt back. Get that inner thigh stretch right here. Knees are open, press the butt back. Okay, now push the hips forward. I'm gonna keep my toes touching. Toes are touching. Look up, feel that stretch in your abdominal. Press it back again. Wide knees. Okay, I'm gonna face you this way. We're gonna have one leg straight and we're gonna go down and up. So I'll show you another view. Straight leg, two, and up. Press the hip forward, three. Press the hip forward. I'm gonna stand over here, four. Now that you can see what I'm doing, five. Six. Seven. One more. I'm gonna change it. Okay. Now we're gonna slide the foot forward and lunge it forward. Slide it out, sit the butt down. Slide the foot forward and press the hips forward. Slide it back out and sit back down. Three, and down. Slide, lunge it. Four more, and up. Slide it, lunge those hips forward. And up. Two more. Seven. And down. Last one. And down. Okay. Now, I'm going to keep both legs just like this. And I'm gonna lean back. Right there, feel that stretch right there. Then throw those hips forward. Go down, then push the hips forward to pull yourself back up. Now if you need to hang on to something and do it like this, you can do that as well. If you need your chair for balance, three. And just tip your butt down and push the hips forward. You can do that as well. Tap the butt down and push the hips forward. You're working your thighs, your quadriceps. So harder is that. Easier is butt tips down and throw the hips forward. Feel this though. Six. And push. Seven and push, it's just a little hip thrust. Eight, oh yeah, you definitely feel that. We have to do other leg. Now I'm sitting my butt down in one. Push the hip forward, two, three, Four, five, six, two more like this. 
One more. Okay. Now, slide. Oh, my, my not sliding so well. Lunge it forward and back. Out. Two. are so sore right now I can feel them five just holding them out just holding them out like this this is the last two and we have one more close and lunge open and set and stand. Okay, right here. Push it back into child's pose. Get the stretch in the shoulders, the lower back. We're gonna go right up into cat and cow. Right here. Cat, inhale, round, push away from the floor. Tuck the chin. And then exhale. Inhale, push away. And exhale. Okay, one more for some mobility. Okay, we're gonna alternate tapping, honey down, and tap and open. Tap. I like tipping the knee, or tip, touching the knees together in between. You're working inner thigh. Tap. Tap. Two. Squeeze. Three. Squeeze, squeeze, five, squeeze, six, two more, squeeze, last one, eight, let's just do the squeeze, one, two, keep your hips lifted, three, four, five, Six. You can do this on your elbows. Eight more. Eight. Seven. Squeeze your glute. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Ah. Yes. Let's just fold it, though. Reach it back, chest expansion, look up. Let's do a neck roll. Other direction. Two more like that. Get all the tension out. One more. tend to tense up in our neck. Okay, let's get the resistance band. We're gonna start with back. Okay, so I like to use the resistance band because you know, you don't get too sore from doing the resistance band and I know that we just worked back on Tuesday, but you know, using the resistance band will not harm us at all um, from overworking. 
And it also won't make us too sore for what's to come on Saturday. So I'm gonna take my band. I have the 30 pound band. Mine happens to be green. Okay, and actually, you know what? I don't need the handles on because I'm gonna be cinching it up so tight. I don't want them flopping around. We don't need the handles just yet. So I'm gonna grab real tight and I'm gonna be pulling the elbows straight back. And I wanna make sure my back is like as if it were against the wall. So don't lean down, don't go back like this. I want you to literally be straight back. And we're gonna pull back and squeeze that at the back. Pull the elbows back and around, two. I'm gonna be changing this up. Three, we're gonna be doing some high reps. Four, squeeze those shoulder blades in the back. Five, six, seven. We're gonna be doing pulses. Eight, we're gonna pulse, here we go. Pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. We're gonna stick with eights. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. Keep the tension, flat back. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. Four, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, squeeze it. Four more, eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one, three more, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Two more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Last one like this. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now singles. Squeeze, release. Squeeze, and don't go like this. Control it on the way back. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we're gonna hold it, hold it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. We're gonna do it again three more times. Eight, seven, two, one, Release, two more times. Eight, seven, six, five. Release, one more. Eight. Two, one. Ah, okay. Grab onto your toes, round your back. Pull, lift up on your toes, push away your hands. Tuck your chin, open up your shoulder blades. Okay, now we're still doing back, a little bit of rear delt. Okay, I'm gonna put my handles on. Okay, now this time I'm gonna pull the arms straight out like this. Now if you need to go and get an easier band and drop down to a 20 pound or even a 10, go ahead. But I'm opening my arms in a straight T and then releasing it. Pull. Slow, two, three, pull. Slow, two, three. Pull back, slow it down on the way back. Two, three, four. Slow, two, three. Six, slow, two, three. Seven. Oh, I'm feeling it now. Two, three. Last one like this. One, two, three. Okay, I'm gonna open up my legs now. Now I have the handles on. You're gonna be pulling the elbows now. They're at an angle like this. They were like this before. Then they were straight back like this. Now pull it in like a horizontal row if we were facing downward. The elbow goes out and the uh, our hands will come in to the uh, armpit. I have mine crisscrossed. I'm criss, oops, sorry. Crisscrossing my band. 
And go as wide as you can with good tension. So if you need to have your, if this is enough, then do that. But you want tension. I'm gonna open mine up more. Pull, release. Two, and I'm gonna change the cross, don't worry. After we do eight. Three, release. Four, five, six, seven, one more, eight. Okay, I'm changing the cross, crisscrossing the other way now, because it does make a difference, believe it or not. Here we go, I have eight. Eight, release. Seven, really squeeze those shoulder blades back there. Six, five, four, three, two, Stacy! I just saw you. One, whoa! That was, I'm gonna tip my butt forward so that my arms go back a little further. Just gives you that nice stretch you need in your shoulders. And step it back. Hang on to your toes. Let all the tension out. We do need stretches while we're warm. Paula, I was thinking of you in mind with this too because I thought this is less on your feet. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna be going, you know what, and I think I am gonna grab a less resistance band for this one because I want good form. So I'm gonna drop down to the 20 pound. You can drop down to the 10. I wanna make sure we have good form because if you don't have good form and you're struggling too much, how are we gonna be able to do all those pulses? All right, so change your band out. Again, Stacy, man, I hope you got your bands, girl. Because like I said, it's a world of difference when you can change the tensions. Okay, wrap it around, crisscross the applesauce. Or no, don't, hang on. Oh, good, I'm so glad. Paula, so happy. All right, crisscross so that they don't slip off your feet. And again, I'm gonna hang out of the handle like this. And I'm gonna go straight up, three, two, Oh, this is perfect. If I would've used that green band, I never would've got enough of mo mo uh, movement. Three, make a V, two, three, four, one, two, three, five, one, two, three, six, seven, one, two, three, eight, one, two, three. Now we're gonna go up three and down on one. One, two, at the top, release. One, two, at the top, hold and release. Three, two, one, release. Four, two, three, release. Nice flat back, five, two, three, release. Six, two, three, release. I'm shaking out. Three, release. Two, three, one more. One, two, three, oh, release. That is exhausting. Stretch it out, bring it across. So you're working shoulders on that one as well. Again, shoulders, you're working back. Shake it out over here. Okay. Let's put, I'm trying to see if I want to keep this one on there. No, nope, I don't. We're switching back to the green one, 30 pounds. It only takes two seconds to switch these out, so don't worry. Okay. We're crisscrossing. We're gonna hang on to our, and cinch up where you need to. I'm actually gonna be grabbing just below the handles, and you're gonna lean back. Okay, so we're, we're gonna be doing bicep curls here. All right, to the shoulder, three, two, one. 
Now all, not all the tension is released. Look at, see, watch. Three. My arms are not flat down like this. Up. One, two, three, four. Up. One, two, three, four. Up. Five, release, two, three, four. Six, release, two, three, four. Seven, release, two, three, four. Eight, release, two, three, four. Now we're gonna go out the sides, here we go. Up, we're making a W, two. Keep your palms facing up. Up, one, two, three, four four, up to the shoulders, one, two, three, four. They're coming out the sides, swing it up the sides, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, six, seven, one, two, three, four, eight, one, two, three, four. Now, up, alternate, two, three, you're just at a 90, four with your elbow, five, six, seven, eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, roll it up. Okay, now in this one we're going to do lats, and again, this is kind of actually good to finish up, you know, after we've worked back with the resistance band stuff because we're not overworking the muscles, but we are going to get more flexibility doing these. So, I have my green, 30, and I have, I have good tension on it. Now, I wrapped it around my hands. I wrapped it around my hands one time, and I'm hanging on to it. Oh, I love this song. Now again, I'm just kneeling, and you can do this sitting. I'm just doing this because it's just comfortable. Okay, we're working on our back anyways, or our lats. So this is that meat right here that everyone complains about. We're gonna get rid of that right here. Here we go. One, two, get your head out of the way, and release, two, three. I'll show you different view. One, two, get my head out of the way. One, two, three. So straight out the sides with the arms. Now up, two, three. I just get my head out of the way so I can go straight out the sides. Two, three, up, two, three. Five, two, three, up, two, three. Six, two, three, up, two, three. Seven, two, up, two, three. Now down on one. One, slow up three. One, two, three. Two, pull those arms apart. Three, up, two, three. Four, up, two, three. Five, up, two, three. Six. Seven. Eight. Up. Two. Three. Guess what? Now we're going down three, up one. One, two, three. Release it, but don't let it fly back up. Two, two, three. Up. Three. And up. Four. Up. Five. Two. Three. Six. Two. Three. Seven. One more. Eight. Release. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're gonna do a tricep now. I'm 
gonna stay kneeling down and I think I'm gonna put my handles on. I have the, the band underneath my legs. If you're sitting in a chair, which you can, just loop the band underneath your chair under the seat, under the seat. You don't wanna put it underneath, if you have a chair that's low, put it underneath the seat. Cause you wanna be able to do this right here. We're gonna hang on to them together. We're hanging on to the two and we're gonna go. So it's actually on the back, here I'll show you. You can see it right here. Up and down. Two, my palms are facing each other. Three, together. Only hinge the elbow, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now I'm gonna do palms facing up, up and down. Two, I'm, I'm looping my thumbs together on the band, but I want my palms facing up, four and back. Five, only hinge the elbows. Six, seven, eight, now pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, release. Now palms face in each other. I'm grabbing onto them together. One, oh, sorry, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Woo! Oh! I'm letting it thaw out for a second. <laughs> Woo! All right, give it a stretch. And a stretch. Okay. All right, so I am kneeling. Again, if you're not kneeling, if you are uh, in a chair, loop it underneath your chair. We just wanna be able to go up a little bit. Five, six, seven, together now. Eight, seven, six, five, four, straight back, three, two, one. Okay, I'm just gonna show you another angle. We're gonna pulse at the top, or alternate, and then do singles. Again, my arms are not locked out. I have a little bend. One, alternate, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now together, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, one more set alternating. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now both. Eight, seven, six, five, four, oh, three, two, one. Oh my goodness. When it bites, it bites good with the band. I'm not lying. Oh, it bites good. Oh, I'm gonna go into child's pose and push my head through my arms, reach forward. Okay. All right. I'm gonna use, well, I was gonna use a fire walker, but you know what? This, this workout, it is whatever I feel. So I'm gonna put my foot in this loop. And I'm gonna hang on to it right here. And if you have something you wanna, you know, we're gonna kick straight out, okay? So again, if you wanna loop it around a pole, which I could do that, or you wanna put the door stopper in your door and um, loop it through and make sure you hang on to it real tight, you can do that as well. I'm just gonna loop it around my hand right here so that it doesn't move. And I'm gonna reach my hand forward because I want good tension. We're pushing it straight out and back in. So I have, here we go, my foot in the loop. Two, and in. Three. Six. 
six, seven, eight. Now I'm only gonna come in halfway. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All the way in and push. If your hand's hurting you, loop it around a couch, leg, three, in, four, press that heel straight back, five, six, seven, eight, halfway, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All the way in, we have one more set. Now, I'm gonna change hands. I'm not gonna loop it around, I just figured out if I crisscross it over the other side, it won't rub my leg, two. Okay, I figured it out as I go. Three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, halfway in, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ah, yes, you do feel, all right, so obviously, like I said, I found that I just looped it and I'm hanging on to it with the opposite, opposite hand. That way it doesn't rub I don't know why, I just thought of that. Wow, how about that? Okay, oh my gosh, I heard to get up. S switch legs. All right, I just wanna see. Stacy's on with us. Okay, same deal, other side. Now, remember, I'm gonna hang on to it with the opposite hand. So put your foot in the loop. So the band comes through your legs, then just, I just double up the loop so I can hang on to it real tight. Get your tension. We have three sets of press out and then half ways. So, all right, so if I feel like there's not enough tension, I'm going to adjust it with my hand. Okay. And you can reach that hand forward also. Yep, that's good. Two, I want tension all the way at the bottom. Three, it's not gonna work your buns of steel if you don't get tension. Five, six, seven, eight, halfway, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All the way in, press it out. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, halfway, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, ah, one, in, last set. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, halfway, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Now, I have sweat rolling down the side of my face. I don't know what happened. All of a sudden, it just started working. Okay. Oh, get that stretch. There's one more I wanna do with the, uh, the loop, the resistance loop. Okay, reach it forward. I'm just gonna give a glute stretch right now. These stretches, we're gonna be fitting them in in between the exercises.
Okay. Oh, oh, that one hurt. Get the tension out. Okay. I'm going to do one more since I know I was super tight. I'm just going to fold my foot over and cinch up my knee, my foot and then scoop my butt as close as I can, getting that gluten hip open. Yep, that felt good. Step it back. Cross it over. Go as far as you can. If you're right here, that's fine. Do whatever you can feel. A good stretch. Cinch it up, and if you need more, then tip the butt forward. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Release it. Okay, let's get our fire walker. Let's get the loop. I have number three. It's medium. Medium resistance. Now... Okay, so I have it just below the knees because I don't want it to roll up. And I have my feet kind of wide, and I'm gonna lift up. And I'm gonna be opening and closing. Two, three, you can also do this. Four, five, I really wanna focus on the hips and glute six, seven, eight, eight, seven. I just like the extra glute work here, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Now pulse out. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Release. Now pulse open. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now up. Eight, seven. You're going to feel it different. Six, five, four, three, two, one. One, tip it down. Do you feel the difference? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Two more sets. Up, eight, four, three, two, one. Down, open, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Last set. Up, eight, seven. Six, five, four, three, two, one, down. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We're not done. Two, one. Keep going. Keep going with these. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two more sets. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One more set. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one. Ha! Okay, you can stop now. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to put it around my feet and I'm going to lean down. Now it's around my feet. Now we're pulsing two, three, release. You're going to feel it different. All these different angles working the outer thigh. One, two, three, release. One, two, three, release. Four, two, three, release. Five, two, three, release. Six, two, three, release. Seven, two, three. Eight, two, three. Keep going. Nine, two, three. Ten, two, three. Eleven, two, three. You're pulsing it out. Twelve. Four more. Four, two, three. Three, two, three. Two, two, three. One. Oh yeah, we had to because, reason being, you really weren't feeling it until after those eight and you know it. So we had to keep pushing it. Okay, now we're just gonna alternate bringing in a knee, a knee, hold it. Flex that foot so that you can hang on to your band. And then the other one, hold it and release. Hold it, we're working on hip flexor and core here. And release, four, release, five, two, three, release. Now I'm gonna lean forward, six, two, three, just to engage the upper ab, seven, 
Now I'm going to be simultaneously switching. One, two, three, switch. Two, two, three, switch. Three, four, five, six. I'm reaching forward to engage my upper, upper abdominal. Seven, eight. Now alternate. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pulse. Three, two, one. Switch. Three, two, one. Switch. Three, four, two, three, five, two, three. Reach forward. Six, two, three. If you need to put your hands behind your head, go ahead. Seven. Eight, two, now alternate. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. We're done. Good job. All right, so I'm gonna use this band to really pull my leg forward. So I'm gonna enhance this band and just let it pull my leg forward. And this is also gonna help if you wanna tip it out to the side. You can release some of the band to make it a little easier. And transfer over and across and hold it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Switcheroo. Other leg straight. If you need to have a bend in this leg, go right ahead. Two, three, four. Okay, and out the side, hold it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and switch it over. Other arm, look over your hand. On the other side, two, three, four. And back to center. Okay, roll it up one vertebrae at a time. Okay, open it up. Cinch it forward. We got to work on this. Okay, again, wherever you can, it's your it's your stretch. Okay, walk the hands forward. Inhale. Now release and exhale. And walk it back up. All we're gonna do is go to this side and walk it down. If you need to bend this leg behind, you can do that. Totally up to you. I'm gonna walk it down and hold. Eight. Oh, I love the stretch. When you reach these arms forward, you really feel it in your lower back. Okay, we're gonna walk it forward on this leg too. And I reach this arm as far forward as I can and hang onto my foot and really feel that stretch in my lower back. Two, three. Ah, walk out of it. Close the legs. Walk down as far as you can. Try to see if you can get maybe even the elbows to the ground. Whatever you can do. But reach it forward and lay down right on top of your legs, two. Okay, and we did all of our stretches really in between, so we're just looking up here. Last stretch, two. And forward. Walk it in. We're in our natural squat. And if you want to do this, you can natural squat with your, to your toes out. A lot of people find this a little easier with their toes out and your hands are in between. Use your, uh, your arms to push away your knees and get a deeper stretch. Two, three, four. This reminds me of a frog, doesn't it? <laughs> I feel like a frog prince. Okay, up, inhale. 
exhale, big inhale, and exhale. All right, you guys, I started late, but I finished on time. Okay, you guys, thanks for joining me, Elizabeth. I know you're gonna do this later. Let me know, I'll make sure and check that it's on YouTube. Okay, let me know, guys, if there's any problems ever with videos, with sound, I'm always downloading to YouTube, okay? So I just realized um, some of the videos I downloaded, I had it on private and didn't even know it. So again, let me know, your feedback helps me. So I'm gonna be downloading to the YouTube channel for anything that happens with the lag or whatever, um, but it, it'll, they're, they're all downloaded on YouTube, okay? Peace to you guys. Have a beautiful day. Thanks.